So I have seen a couple more anime movies that have come out in the 2010s. And now I'll be giving them the ranking. As it rolls, of course, we'll be giving all the new movies. Moana is at 7. I get, I get, yeah, Mo, why is Moana on it? Did I put Moana or something else I haven't, before I seen it? Yeah, I don't know why Moana was on this list. Uh, well, let's put this pick on me, free. Okay, so, we good. Where's Moana? Um, now I can't find it. There it is. I gotta put it back. And down here. Down here. Any other movies? Is here. Uh, first of all, we're gonna go to the adjustments. Yep, the adjustments. Everybody's favorite. The adjustments. Okay, I'm not gonna move cards for you. I, I, you know, boss baby, I'm gonna move back up here. Uh, bad. Yeah, this goes to the 2 out of 10. Yeah. This goes to Fuego movie. That's garbage. Garbage. I mean, we'll check the final chapter. Garbage. Trash. Uh, I think the 1 out of 10 stay the same. They still got all god. They're all bad movies. So, what are the updates? So, first movie updated is What Breaks the Internet. It's mediocre, mediocre. Uh, not my favorite. Not, my, yeah, not, not the. Uh, next is Captain Underpants, the first epic movie. Okay, it's not really. Uh, where would Captain Underpants go? Uh, goes here, with Monsters University, Madagascar Free, the, you know, Cyborg movie, Peanuts movie, Rio and Rio Two, and Stars and Stuppy. It goes down. Uh, next is Inside Out. Uh, Inside Out, I think, go... You know, it's good when Pexa actually makes original stuff, because that's actually good. That stuff is actually good, but... This sequel stuff, like Toy Story 4. No, no one wants... Like, really, Toy Story 4? Come on, Pixar. Like, you can't think of anything new as move this this pick me free down. I don't... <laughs> Hoodwink 2 I've never seen before, so I'm going to put that back. I've never seen the first one. Harry V2 was garbage. Uh, Spongebob, this movie, that was also garbage. No, I, haven't, I actually have not seen this movie. I don't know why it's on the tier list. They play with nut job. Job. I have some... Incredibles 2 can be at 5 out of 10. I still don't like the movie. Uh, Home. I have not seen Home. I must be moving to all the movies I have not really seen. Be buying Zorban. have not seen it. Put it back. Uh, oh man, the one out of ten sort of movies that I just looked at, so I was like, yeah, I don't want to see it. This looks garbage, basically. For example, Spark. Like, what? The? I actually don't really bring push Spark moves in my opinion, Spark back. But the rest is just movies that I'm never gonna see. So, uh, next is Moana. I, no, uh, yeah, Moana. Uh, goes Moana goes here. Yeah, people are gonna be pissed off that I put Moana in the same tier as Cars 2, Ice Age, Cruise and Course, and Bosch Baby. Yeah, that's gonna definitely piss people off, but. As 7 out of 10 still means I like the movie. Okay, next movie is Kubo and the Two Strings. Okay, where would he put Kubo and the Two Strings? Because really, I still only hate a lot of movies. If you look here, there's not a lot of movies in these tier. And below, mediocre, bad, awful, terrible, and abysmal with the most movies that I just do not care for. Kubo goes up here. Uh, next movie is Coco. I can put Coco also by Kubo up here. No movies that I, I don't think, no new movies I think are in the perfect tier. Uh, next movie. I have not seen any of these movies here. They made a second. They made a second one? They made a second one. <laughs> they actually seriously made a second one. Yeah. Um. Next movie is Pets 2. What score would I give Pets 2? Hmm. I'm surprised we don't have the Donkey King here. That would, that would be down here, Donkey King. But Pets 2 will go here. Pretty funny. It's funny how that's how I thought the first movie would be like. 
And the last movie is the Angry Birds 2. Okay, the Angry Birds 2 is actually better than the first movie. It actually goes in the great category. It seems that Sony has really improved the game. That, this movie was actually made by Sony. Animated by Sony, not Rovio Animation. It's in. Yo. Know, and the movie actually sadly underperformed at the box office because really, Angry Birds is not really the talk of the town anymore. So, it's also a, it also has a sequel. It also has a sequel negative. Which again, not too surprising. So there we go about the animated movie ranking here. Yeah. And no and I'm gonna see if there's any other changes I could make. Uh Brave goes down. Simple Brave is even worse than the good good dinosaur and the Incredibles. <laughs> Dude. Good dinosaur is mediocre. Epic is <laughs> Epic goes bad. Epic is bad. Not not, not even mediocre. Epic goes bad. I've tried to watch it. It's like why do I why do I own this movie? Both of the quality of a chance of meatball movies were not that great. The second one is not is bad. Um I have not seen Wonder Park or Walk Dog or As and Crank. Uh the I'm gonna put some of these movies back here yeah, back. Oh man and wildlife. All the rest of the movies deserve to be here. <laughs> All the rest of like the garbage movies, the Arctic Dogs. I don't, I don't, I don't want to see the movie. I might eventually see that, and it'll probably still stand a one out of ten because it looks, just looks garbage. Same thing with Frozen one two. I just do not like Frozen. I, I cannot stand Frozen. I cannot stand the songs. I cannot stand the characters. I cannot stand anything about Frozen, and its sequel. Okay, I just cannot stand. Frozen. Yeah. I tried watching Frozen multiple times when I was younger. I tr I gave it like multiple chances too. I, I could not stand it. And the, se the sequel goes in the same spot too. I just cannot stand the characters of Frozen and the songs. The songs of Frozen are just terrible. The characters are just terrible. The villain is just terrible. Everything about Frozen is just terrible. Same thing with Trolls. I have not seen Trolls, but I just do not want to see it. So it looks terrible. Cool. Sea Titans, I don't like Sea Titans Go, so simple as that. Ugly Dolls, it looks terrible. I'll probably eventually will waste my time watching Ugly Dolls. You know, when I could be watching better movies than Ugly Dolls. Yeah, but yeah. I'm going to see if there's any other movies I missed. Why do you have the Donkey King here? Well, Donkey King would be on this list too. But yeah, most of seem like every made the movie. That's surprising. That's not surprising at all. Most of seem like every made the movie. I was just out of play with your movie. It stays in the abysmal section <laughs> of the emoji movie. Miles needs moms. Miles needs moms is another movie I absolutely dreaded. Young when I was younger, that movie was just absolutely just disturbing. That's the only word I can describe it. Nor the North. Think I, I'm never gonna watch. I might. I might. I might for myself to watch Nor the North, but I think Nor the North is gonna be at one out of ten no matter what, because Nor the North is gonna be garbage. The emoji movie, yeah, I'm not. I am never gonna watch the emoji movie. I I, I just watched the trailers. And I always said, yeah, this is like one of the worst movies ever made. <laughs> and I don't even, even have to watch the movie. That's the emoji movie is that bad. I don't even have to watch the emoji movie. V and they have it constantly on TV too. They have the emoji movie constantly on TV. So now we go to the terrible movies. Okay, these are all explainable. Uh, Planes two. I have not actually seen Planes two, so I'm gonna move it from the list. Uh. Walk your dinosaurs 3D, uh, garbage, Shrek 3D, Shrek, gar Shrek 4, garbage, Lego movie, garbage. Uh, we can move, uh, plain, we can move Happy Feet too. I've never, oh, I think I've never seen Happy Feet here. That's like, that, that one's the bad one. Uh, planes, garbage, sausage party, 
bad. And we have epic bad minions. I'm going to put minions back in mediocre. Uh, Puss in Boots I've not seen. I don't know why that's even on the list. Smallfoot. I've not seen Smallfoot. I don't want to see it either. Uh, then we have mediocre. Uh, Brave. Okay. Free Birds is being pushed down to bad. Warax have not seen that movie before. Actually, I have five, five remember seeing it, but I have not actually seen it. Uh, why is the guy in Speedy Oka? Don't really remember much, but why is it the guy in Probably wasn't that great of a movie to begin with. Well, Breaks the Internet, Incredibles 2, Minions, and Waves. I want to create this in mostly Disney movies. You would think that it would be mostly filled with DreamWorks movies and Illuminator movies. But it's Disney gained the L again. Disney gained the L again. <laughs> Four, f two Pixar movies, three Pixar movies, and one Disney movie. And we have Avids. We have Zootopia, Cows Free. Uh, actually, Cows Free, I think it. I don't, I don't, I've watched Cows Free like once. I have the movie on Blu ray. I haven't really watched, watched it again. I watched Cows 2 again, but not really Cows Free. I've not really watched Cows 1, but I remember Cows, Free being a, Cows 1 being a pretty good movie. I've seen the whole first Total Transylvania movie. It's mediocre. I can put it back in mediocre. I've seen it once. It's okay. It's not the greatest movie. It was a net mad movie. Uh, Zootopia. Uh, did not like Zootopia. Did not really care for Zootopia. Average storks. Average. The wolf scene was pretty funny, but other than that, yeah, meh. Uh, Randy Pooh. Uh, that's not really even a movie. It's a compilation of sorts. The Spiggle Me Free. Uh, meh. Average. Uh, good movies. These are movies I remember liking. Uh, Pets 2. It was funny. I watched that recently. Moana. It's fun. Uh, most of these movies are less fun and good. Uh, or at least have interesting stories that keep them going. Yeah. But most of these movies are good. Then we have the great movies. Okay. Here. And then we have the amazing movies. And then we have the perfect movies. Yep. And you don't have to agree with my ranking. Everybody's ranking is different, of course. But, yep. Yeah. I think Isaac's Christian course goes down to 6 out of 10. And it's all things that stupid, annoying, you know, freaking Wama. I hate that freaking guy. He's so annoying. Okay, he's like the... He's like the most annoying character in the entire franchise. And, you know, that's saying a lot. There's a lot of annoying characters in the Ice Age franchise as well. Okay. Captain Gut from the fourth movie. For, no, if Captain Gut from the fourth movie. Captain Gut from the fourth movie said sometimes it's pretty annoying. But, it, and, the, and the part in Crash and Eddie. But it takes a special kind of annoying to be super... So bad. You know, only people like 20 minutes in it. You only have like screen time of 10 minutes. They are all one of the most annoying and worst characters of all in the entire franchise. Besides, and he's even on the freaking front cover, too. Signifying he's such a great and important character. Absolutely. <laughs> because of him, he goes down to 6 out of The movie goes down to 6 out of 10. Because of the annoying Wama. The Dari Wama. Yeah, what a funny pun, too. Yeah, I think we also got it. I, know, I think the second movie ended the movie perfectly. I don't think they needed a third movie. It would have been like, you know, making a toy. It would be making like a Toy Story 4, which they actually did make a Toy Story 4. Just so again, so that, you know, Bo Peak became a feminist. <laughs> that's the whole big question. But, yeah, that's basically about this movie, the video. Goodbye.